Stop guessing which AI tool to use. Today, I'm breaking down the big three, Taft for sheer volume, Futurepedia for learning skills, and open tools for developers. First up is Taft. It's absolutely massive, currently tracking over 42,000 AI tools across every category imaginable. The real magic is the natural language search. Instead of guessing keywords, just type exactly what you need. AI video editor for YouTube. Hit enter and look at that. It filters specifically for your use case. Or just hit the logo to see the just released timeline. Look at this. Tools released literally two hours ago. It's the best way to spot trends before anyone else. While Taft is about quantity, Futurepedia is about quality. Look for that blue verified badge. It means a human actually tested it. You can even strict filter for free trials or mobile apps to avoid wasting time. But the real game changer is this. AI courses. It's not just a directory, it's a school. Clicking here takes you to Skill Leap, a library of structured guides ranging from generative AI to digital marketing. The layout is fantastic. You can scroll through the full curriculum to see what you'll learn and even watch a free intro lesson right there to see if the teaching style clicks with you. The layout is fantastic. You can scroll through the full curriculum to see exactly what you'll learn and even watch a free intro lesson right there to see if the teaching style clicks with you. Finally, for the developers, open tools. This isn't for browsing, it's for building. It provides the standard APIs you need to connect LLMs to the real world. The registry is a goldmine. You can find model context protocol servers for Stripe, GitHub, or Linear. Let's click on the Notion integration to see how it works. Look at this detail. It gives you the full API schema, allowing you to build an AI agent that can actually read your notes and update your databases automatically. So here is the final verdict. Use Taft if you want the biggest database. Go to Futurepedia if you want curated tools and courses. And choose Open Tools if you are a developer building AI apps. Links are in the description. See you in the next one.